हेलो वेलकम टू द क्लास ऑफ इंग्लिश आई एम प्रोफेसर हरदास सानिल दामोदर एज वी डिड टेक इन टू कंसिडरेशन द फर्स्ट पार्ट ऑफ द पोएम टाइटल्ड एज फादर रिटर्निंग होम इन द फर्स्ट पार्ट वी डिड टेक इन टू कंसिडरेशन दैट द पोएट्स फादर वॉज ट्रैवलिंग using the mode of traveling that is the train in the evening he used to travel from the one place to the another place mentioned as a suburban area due to old age he was unable to see the things clearly with his eyes and the next part of the poem we are going to study now dear students as you have your own experiences with your own fathers if they are old they need your support help and you should keep on sharing your ideas and views well take a look at the first line the next half of the poem he hurries across the length of the gray platform it is gray due to cement here gray platform suggest old age dullness and sordidness of the poet's father's life so one can understand that the platform where the structure is done the use of cement the platform is made of with the help of cement and the color of it is mentioned as gray that is gray platform is mentioned here next line crosses the railway line enters the lane after getting out of the train the poet's father is in a hurry he started walking towards the home and he crosses the railway line first then enters the lane where his house was there and in the next line he chappals are sticky with mud but he hurries onward even though his chappals are stained with mud he did not think of it a lot he kept on walking rather fast rather speedily towards home without thinking of the dirt and the chappals full of mud and they are sticky with mud it is said that so not thinking of all these filthy things dirty things he kept on walking rather speedily towards home in the next line home again i see him drinking weak tea well one can understand that if a person is received properly he is given hot tea but the father of the poet receives rather weak tea it means that he is not welcome at home with the usual way of receiving that's why he did not get the proper treatment from the family members at home so he is not received well and the family members ignore him or do not take care of him properly that's why he got weak tea in the next line eating a stale chapati reading a book he did not get fresh hot food especially chapati it means that he did not 
get the hot recipes food and that's why family members do not give him proper treatment take care of him with proper respect and that's why he felt alienated he keeps spending much of his time in loneliness in solitude and he also likes to keep on reading different books in order to spend his time he did not even share his ideas with his family members so most of the time he used to spend in solitude in loneliness because he is alienated from the family members at home next line he goes into the toilet to contemplate to contemplate means to think deeply so the meaning of it is given to you think deeply contemplate well after having reached home he straight away went to the toilet to get fresh where he used to spend as much time as he could to contemplate to think deeply about the things how he spent the whole day and he likes to contemplate there that was the only place where the father can contemplate think deeply for his sake next line man's estrangement from a man made world when the world is created by a man where a man himself has to spend much of his time in loneliness he is alienated from the rest of the world even though the necessity is there to communicate with one another by using words expression feelings ideas thoughts etc but people do not give as much time as they can that they should spend much of their time with their family members but it is here father has lost his faith his trust with the other family members even family members do not like to share their valuable time with their loved ones that is father at home next line coming out he trembles at the sink sink that is the place where washings are done of the different utensils at home in the kitchen the pot is used in order to wash the utensils where he used to wash his hands after coming out the toilet he used to wash his hands and at that very moment his hands tremble okay the cold water running over his brown hands and due to coldness of the water he feels the trembling quite often and his hands became very wet they became soggy and a few drops of water had been collected over his hand the color of the hand is mentioned which is brown and due to oldness he trembles a lot so this is how we have seen throughout these lines the color of the platform which is gray the use of cement is there but it is here dullness sordidness old age of the poet's father 
one can see well we are going to see the remaining few lines from the poem afterwards